What's up, peeps? This is your boy T coming to you live with another book review. It's about that time of year, it's that season, football season is in. Sorry, I'm a little late. Your boy just gets real busy, if you know what I mean. I'll be out here mingling and just doing my thing. Well, you know what season it is. Let's get right to it. I think this book was perfect for the season. I seen it, and I'm like, oh yeah, I had to get that one under my belt. I was reading it, and one of my boys was like, yo, man, I heard of that one. Like, is that a good one? I'm like, I don't know. Let me finish it. I finished it. Come to find out, there's a movie on it. There's a couple movies on it. Let's get right into it. Brian's Song by William Blinn. Okay, okay. We're talking about the book. The word, the way this book is written, I don't know what this like stanzas or what it's called, but it's like scripted. It's like a movie script. You know, Brian, it'll say Brian, then his dialogue, then, um, it, it's just written kind of weird. Linda's dialogue, um, Gail's dialogue, and it's like, yo, after a while, it, you know, it gets irritating to read, but... Once you get it, you get it. It's like, oh, man. Either way, it's a good story. Read the story. It's cool. I like it because it fits in my pocket. I was taking this everywhere I went. Now, I even put it in my back pocket. Um, But I like books that fit in my pocket. It was on sale. It was in an expensive book. So I wasn't paying 50 bucks or something like that. You know, probably like 10 bucks. It was worth it because I made a lot of money reading that book. Um... Football's back, and it's, man, the underdogs are up right now. Anybody team? Okay, so Brian's song, right? It's about this guy, right? And there was some football going on. I would never spoil a book, all right? I would never spoil a movie, neither. But there's football in this. If you like football, check this out. <laughs> and then when he went when and got the football, and they kicked it, and... The, <laughs> I, I don't give no spoilers, but yo, Brian's song is cool. It's kind of old school, but it's tight. I mean, if you're a football lover like me, you know, you got to read this one. You got to read it first and then watch it because it's gonna it's a struggle trying to read it. But then when you watch it, you enjoy it more. That's how I'm, I, like, I, that's how I'm doing like books that were turned into movies. I'm, I'm going to try to read the book first and then watch the movie. You know, I'm not a fast reader, so I might... Hold up, give me a sec. So I might need some time with it. This one got some vocals in the back. You know, I try to have a little playlist going. But, um, you know, I'm not I'm not a speed reader. So I might take some time for me to read a, a book, like a Michael Crichton, Jurassic Park or something. It might take me a minute to read that one. Um, so... Like I said, I like to read the book before I watch the movie. There's another one I got like that coming, too. I don't want to spoil that. But it got to do with food. That one got to do with food. Um, so I read this one, right? And then I told myself I was going to watch it with my, with my grandparents. Because, you know, my grandparents really like sports. Oh, man, there's one scene that had my grandparents dying. They just cannot stop. We c I couldn't stop laughing either because... It's funny when you read it in the book, but then when you see it in the movie, you're like, ah, oh, no, he did it, bro. Um, but I heard that there's an updated movie of this. I seen the original one. The one that this picture right here, this is the one that I seen. Movie was tight. I liked it. It was good, man. That was a good. If you like football, man, check that out. You got any football recommendations? Um, and football book recommendations, send them my way. I got the Don Shula book. I got the Eric Dickerson book. You know what, I'm not, I'm not even going to keep saying all the books that I got because now I'm just spoiling. Now you guys know what's going to come in the book reviews ahead. But um, Brian's song, this was a good one. I had a lot going on, so it took me a minute to read. I had this read, read a while back. I should have been hit you guys with a um, with a book review, but I've just been so busy. Like I said, football's back, man. I mean, everybody got to work. I got to have a life. I got to hit the gym. There's things I got to do, you feel me? Um... Brian's song. It was just only eight bucks, dude. Got the, still got the 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 um the price tag on it. But um, football's back. Comment your football team in here and let's talk. That's how I put all my friends together. I put all the Raiders together. I put all the Cowboys together. All the Rams. 
But you guys all go together, you know what I'm saying? That way, there ain't no discrepancy. And you guys can have your cookouts together, your barbecues together, you know? You know how people do. But, um, oh man, let me get a little professional. I didn't realize I had one button. <laughs> That's a new thing. Everybody gonna be rocking the one button open. Um, the football season's back. I'm, 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 I'm loving it, but then I'm hating it because it's different. You know, I, I was in the NFL bit the other day. We had a meeting with the, with with a, my with my company. Can't say too much, but it's like, man, I love the game, but sometimes, man, now I'm seeing the 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 business side of it. And the business side, man, is lovely, but there's some ugly parts too. If you guys don't know how to act when you go to a football game, don't come to a football game, please. Right now, I'll be scrolling on the timeline. I've seen all types of fight videos and stupid people just being stupid. Don't don't be that person. Come out, have a good time, be respectful with your family. Kids, I'm telling you, take your kid to a football game, they're probably going to go professional. If I would have went to, to a football game when I was a kid, I went there when I was an adult. If I would have went when I was a kid, I, I would have went all the way. Now that I look at it and I got the whole perspective, I'm like, I could have been, been playing. But enough of the shoulda, woulda, coulds. Brian song, William Blinn. This is a good book. Homeboy from the Godfather is in there. I forgot the name of his name. And they got uh, was it was it Billy D. Williams? They got they got some people in this movie. I don't want to, you know me. I'm not gonna spoil it, but I'm, I'm gonna give you some juice. It's a good book right here. Give it a read, man. It's only what a hundred pages, hundred plus. It's a little bit, a little bit over a hundred. Worth it. Well worth the read. And I'm gonna give you a quick little look. Look, people, how the stanzas are. What we got, Brian. Gail, Gail said, Brian said, Gail said, that's the only thing I don't like. If you can get past that, if you can process the script, straight. The book is cool, man. It got some funny parts, especially when you see it in the movie. You'll be like, oh, no, he did it, boy. Yeah, but football's back. The competition's back. Let's keep it friendly. Let's keep it lovely. You feel me? We got a couple weeks that we got going with this football. A lot more book reviews coming. A lot going on in the world. I wouldn't even know where to begin at this point. But, um... My heart's in it. Let's play ball, you know, growing up. It is what it is. Never thought I'd even be having access to the field like I do. You know, I went to Super Bowl this year. Still, my mind is still blown. Like, bro, you was at Super Bowl. Crazy. Um, Back to the books. Find me on, good, on the Goodreads app. Any recommendations, send them my way. I'm on all your social medias. YouTube, Snapchat, Instagram, MySpace, you name it. I'm there. If I'm not there, send it to me. I'm going to be there. Um, but yeah, drop your teams in your comments, and you know, in the comment section, I'll put all you guys together, you know, we have a big old ball, we can have a smack talking in the comment section, I don't mind, you know, I'm not one of them dudes, you got some people who be like, um, I treat it like a roast room, you guys can go back and forth, as long, as long as you guys will take to the streets, we all good, you know what I'm saying, but just keep it friendly, keep, keep it classy with your sportsmanship, you know, have some good sportsmanship, like these fighters out here, but um, Expect a lot more from your boy. It's probably going to be late because I'm late all the time. I'll be late to work. It's everything. That's just, I'm late. Late tea, whatever you want to call it. But, um, yeah. Some good reads. I got a couple other books that are coming at you, but I try to give you enough time to soak them all up. You know, I'll, I'll give you the book. You go back and read it. You can go ahead and watch the movies along with it. Recommendations. Send them my way because I'm building my list. I got some I got some good ones lined up. I don't know how long it's going to take me to, to read them, but I'm about to read them. Oh, be safe. Be safe in these streets. A lot of rappers out here getting killed, kids getting killed. The, the world ain't safe. Just be safe, all right? Sometimes better to stay home and just stay on your phone. I don't know. But, um, just take, you know, be a good person in the world. Do the right thing, you guys. And I'll catch you guys on the, on, on the, next, um, the next book review. Peace.